Well, the stage is truly set for what should be a terrific night of football here at Anfield. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And with the new campaign just moments away from getting underway, the excitement in here is palpable. It is Liverpool against Paris Saint-Germain. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Well, it's fair to say they had some challenges last season, culminating in the relegation, but they can't let that dampen their spirits. It's so important they wipe the slate clean now and start this campaign as they mean to go on. Three points will play a huge part in that. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson begins in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Mohamed Salah plays with Sadio Mane out wide. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Derek, they must finish here. And there it is! The opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Well, they get the ball moving again. What effect will that goal have on PSG? We're going to find out here. Well, a good tackle. Kimpembe. Di Maria. Now with Hakimi. Messi. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Virgil van Dijk. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Defensive efficiency personified. Oh, is he going to be punished here? Cuts it back. And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, here it is again. And how many times have we seen in recent games teams trying to play out from the back, not doing it particularly well, giving away sloppy possession, and then finding the ball in the back of their net? Well, a second goal for them here. And he stopped them just when they looked menacing. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. Opportunity! And it's in! This game very much back on as a contest! Well, here's the replay. And sometimes when you've been pressed high up the field, you have to go that little bit longer and not play out through the thirds. And that's what they tried to do here. They had their pocket picked and suddenly they find the ball in the back of the net. Salah. It's a good Liverpool move in the making. Able to skip past his man. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Di Maria. Mbappe. Well, he might be onto something. Oh, but he's done brilliantly to cut it out. And a PSG corner. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. It is to be a throw-in. Kimpembe. Mbappe. Went in strongly, decisively. Mbappe. This could be the equaliser, but oh, what an important save! How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. Di Maria, determined block. And they have possession again. 
And Messi carries it forward. What's he going to do from this position? Pulls it back. Very much run of the mill as saves go. Andrew Robertson. It's with Fabinho. Henderson. Fabinho. Well, approaching the half-time whistle and PSG narrowly behind. Stuart, your assessment to this point? Well, it's been a good game so far. And... Oh, they might score here, Stuart. Still possibilities. And dispossessed. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like this. Decisive pass from Mbappe. Oh, there it is! Unbelievable stuff from two down. They're right back in this. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. But in the end, it's far too easy to create the 2v1 against the keeper. What were the defenders trying to do? Nice finish, but poor defensively. Well, back underway here, and they've split the four goals between them so far. And space on the wing for Liverpool. But they took care of the situation defensively. Danilo Pereira. Not a bad pass it was. It's a weighted pass. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. They've regained possession. Oh, a lovely ball. And Mohamed Salah now. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? And that brings to an end. So back in business, the second half underway. It's Liverpool in front, but far from being done and dusted. Fabinho, really getting stuck in. This could square the game, and that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them. Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. Underway once more. Level at 3-3. An alert intervention. It's a good Liverpool move in the making. Oh, what an opportunity! And at the second time of asking, it's a goal. The keeper, meanwhile, looks to the heavens. Well, let's take another look at this. And from the attacking point of view, everything's right. The shot across the goalkeeper, players coming in for the rebound, and there's not much the goalkeeper could do about that. He made a good effort on the first one, couldn't react to the second. Oh, great play. Danilo Pereira. Mbappe. And now Danilo Pereira. A fine use of the ball. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Sends it back. Terrific block there. Oh, that is a majestic goal! Volleyed home with precision and style. Superbly done. As you can 
see. That's a great bit of skill. He times this so sweetly. What a good goal that is. Moving forward effectively. Chances on. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. A PSG corner it is, and potentially an opportunity. Really good challenge. And this might not be the ideal situation for them. Really well hit, but just too much height on it. Well, as you can see, this has been a fairly open contest. Chances at both ends, plenty of a good attack in play, and it's been really entertaining. Verace. Looking for the angle. Cuts it back. Clean challenge. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Danilo Pereira. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power. Hello everyone, great to be with you from Stamford Bridge. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It is Chelsea against Paris Saint-Germain. Thanks Derek, they played well and deserved their win in that first game. But today will be tougher. If they can go out and play with the same energy and the same attitude, I think they get another victory here. They're certainly a team to watch. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Thiago Silva plays with Andreas Christensen in central defence. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And acres of space for PSG out wide. A really top-notch piece of defending. Not a touch off the defender, last of all, so a corner. 
Superb stop. It's Neymar's corner. Not the best clearance. Good tackle. Introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Sergio Ramos in central defence. Lionel Messi starts with Neymar in the wide positions. And handed the task of playing up front today is Kylian Mbappe. Well, they have it again. There's a slide rule pass. And there it is. The opening goal. The ideal way to start. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1 0. Mbappe. Galassi. And into the clutches of the goalkeeper. And a throw in forthcoming. Deciding to go inside. Mbappe. Neymar! And it goes! Two goals in rapid fire fashion. And looking very comfortable here. Well, a second goal for them here. Thiago Silva, Christensen, Marcos Alonso, and it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. A chance to whip it in. Di Maria, Messi, Verratti. On to Messi. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Ramos. It's Kimpembe now. Marquinhos. Kimpembe. Hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. Well, the crowd are certainly not happy. Their team has been totally outplayed here. They're just being passed around far too easily. Verratti. Mbappe! Oh, a smart stop. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Different angle from Verratti. Danilo Pereira. Di Maria. Top class defending. Verratti. Well, possibilities in the centre. Decided to come in from the flank. But ultimately up a cul-de-sac. A really intense pressure applied. It is to be a throw-in. And getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Well, PSG have controlled most of the possession, as you can see. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Messi and they'll get ready for the throw in Ramos and Neymar
adapted well to win the ball back. Defensive efficiency personified. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Marcos Alonso. And they're trying to get right into his face. Well, possibilities inside the box. Mbappe. Superb save. Well, he should score, of course, but that's a brilliant save. Short corner taken. Has a go. Well, it wasn't a taxing save. So a throw in here. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge. So back in business, second half underway, and Chelsea know they really need to lift themselves. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And Chelsea struggling to keep the ball. And space here on the flank. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Theme emerging of wasted possession. Messi, and he might be through here. Well, the attack will peter out. Keeper's ball. The press was on, and it worked. And a long way out here. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. And fed forwards. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. He made it look simple, really. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Careless in possession. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Can they hit on the break? Oh, what an opportunity! What a save! Now, how about the short corner? And he takes it on. Body on the line. Brilliantly blocked. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Well, nothing comes of it in the end because the flag has gone up, Stuart. Well, he knew where the space was, but he's just been too eager. And that's why he's offside. And they're making a change. Thirty minutes left for play. Verratti, ball lost by PSG, and he's through here. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Messi, an unforced error, you've got to say. Well, Chelsea being afforded too much space here. Defensive efficiency personified. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, he really read that brilliantly. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. But into the keeper's gloves. Being pressed and pressed high. Excellent vision. Jorginho. Oh, a nice-looking pass. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Determined defending. Another block. And the upshot of that is offside. Well, he needed to look elsewhere because the flag was always going to go up.
Mbappe. Well timed tackle. He's in behind. Not out of the woods yet. And a goal! Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. Well, two one it is here. And they need to get tighter. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. And Chelsea looking dangerous. This could square the game. And that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point. And momentum is with them. So underway again at 2 all. And they know they need to stop him. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. But really, the goalkeeper should never be exposed that easily. Great team goal, but woeful defending. Well, a dramatic moment near the end. And that might well be the decider. Magnificent defending. Uh, the keeper completely untroubled. Well, the minutes are ticking away. It's not officially a PSG victory yet. They'd love to make it that. Stuart, your thoughts on their performance here? Well, what a finale we have here. Both sides have looked good going forward, but poor defensively. But I do think oh, they... Oh, wait a minute, Stuart. Opportunity. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day. It's superb scoring for him. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Time for the change now. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Defensive efficiency personified. Number 29, Kai Havertz. To be replaced by... Verratti. Kipembe. This is Sergio Ramos. Hakimi. Chelsea throw in here. Well, he has the measure of his man. Can he get one back? Oh, no, is the answer. It was a guilt edge opportunity. He couldn't avail himself of it. You have to say that's a big chance missed. He had to score there. That makes it difficult now. Hakimi, Messi. Well, Chelsea did well to regain control of it. Messi, and he's through here. Well, a piece of quick thinking by the keeper. Well, that's great goalkeeping. He read it so well, didn't he? The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Committed challenge. Well, not very clever defending. Can he finish this? And a goal to seal the hat trick!
Good evening, everyone. Plenty of reasons to expect a compelling contest tonight here in the French capital, Paris. We're at the Pac de Pass. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined, as always, by Stuart Robson. And it really is an intriguing proposition from the point of view of promotion. That could be their reward to Neymar. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Presnel Kimpembe plays with Ashraf. And just making the run a bit too early. Offside as a result. Coman, sloppy. And he read it well defensively. A bit of running room now on the wing. Throw in here for PSG. Lionel Messi's daredevil style of attacking could well make the difference here, Stuart. Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. A very timely interception. Well, not every keeper would have been that brave. Well, he read it brilliantly, didn't he? Top stuff from the keeper. Sané. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. No possibilities inside the box. And a wretched cross, really, over everyone. No space for them here. Teammate available. Body in the way. Going short. Mbappe. On to Di Maria. It is to be a throw in. Leroy Zane. Into the advanced position. Crossing possibilities. Well, no luck keeping possession. It's a splendid through ball from Neymar. Mbappe. And he's made headway. Oh, yes, a goal! And a historic moment to win. Well, that's a big moment for them. They've just got to keep their focus now. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Getting the better of his opponent. He must finish! Still a chance. And stopped there by Marquinhos. Danilo Pereira. Excellent challenge. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Big chance to get them on terms. Oh, it's gone in. And as it stands, they're no longer in line for promotion. Well, the manager will be demanding a response now. He knows it's vital that they get the job done today. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. So in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. One, one. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. And a throw in forthcoming. And the ruling is offside here. Niklas Zule. Mm. 
Useful looking position, you've got to say. Zane in the middle. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Now can they counter clinically? It might be the moment to get them ahead. And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Mbappe! Oh, that's sizzling from Neuer in goal. Di Maria. Müller. The super tackle and they've won possession. How can they create something? Messi. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Couldn't hang on to it. Messi. Oh, good looking run. Has someone to play it to. Oh! Well, just look at those celebrations down there. That could be a huge moment in this club's history. Well, here's the replay. He's done well to get his head up, pick out a teammate, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Well, Bayern restart the game, and that should certainly shake them up a bit. The inside route looking promising. Well, closed down straight away. Coman's pass needed to be better. Messi. And Messi! Oh, it's gone in! Just what they wanted! Prepare for promotion! Well, surely they... Can't let this slip. It must be theirs now. No shortage of goals in this match. 3 1. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Well, he's been forced out of play this time. And that is that for the first half here in the French capital. So into the second half, and Bayern left with a real mountain to climb after what happened in the first 45. Lewandowski. Oh, possibilities inside the box. And running through to the keeper. Well, he's outplayed and outfought him. And very deftly cut out. Can he find the net? And fine goalkeeping. Neymar. PSG looking dangerous. Oh, great attacking play. Mbappe. Well, far from the ideal pass. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. And it's Muller finding forward gears. Cuts it back. Oh, blocked it. Deflected behind. Corner forthcoming. The clearance wasn't decisive.
Verratti. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Opportunity! And not quite accurate enough. Off the post. And it's going to be a goal kick here. Mbappe. Hakimi. Di Maria. Danilo Pereira. Messi. Did well to win the ball back. Mbappe. Now Messi. Can he take advantage? Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like trouble in the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Space and time for the cross. Corner awarded to PSG. Just far too close to the goalkeeper. Verratti. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Might it be Mbappe? A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Well, no stopping him. And a chance to whip it in here. And a tidy tackle. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. And in with a real chance. Oh, that's it. That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. The delivery from Neymar. Well, the defender deserves a bit of credit, to be fair. Yeah, I think you have to give credit to the defending there. Just enough pressure to put him off at that vital moment. Substitution it is for PSG. Coman. It's driven in low. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. And a chance for him on the flank. And he takes on the shot. And not cleared away properly. And a goal it is. But in all honesty, the keeper should have done much, much better. Well, here it is again. And the striker does everything right. Hitting it across the goalkeeper, making it difficult for him. And then a player coming in for the rebound. What a good goal it is. Everything right from the striker's point of view. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Will he play it in? Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Mbappe. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Mbappe. Well, it could be on for him here. The net is steering him in the face. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, but I think the defending is poor. How can the goalkeeper be left so exposed with two players running at him? Mind you, it's still a great team goal. Really good attacking play. Can he finish? And he's certainly in the mood for his second. Well, he's certainly looking a threat. He looks so sharp today. And over it comes. 
Well, he's been ruled offside. Lionel Messi. In with a chance. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And he's won the ball. Well, one eye on the stopwatch, but they are cruising to victory. And surely, Stuart, they can't throw away promotion from here. Well, they deserve this, don't they, Derek? They've played some great football today, as they have for most of the season. Not long to go now. And full time here. Now we can say it is official. Promotion secured. Well, the target at the outset was promotion, and they've achieved it and fully deserve it. They've been brilliant. Well, now they have a chance to catch their breath, assess what they've just done, and think about the future. Well, they can celebrate tonight and then get themselves ready for the remainder of the season. So, Neymar hits the headlines again. Your verdict on what he actually produced? Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today. Mbappe, and he's made headway. Oh, yes, a goal, and a historic moment to boot. Well, that's a big moment for them. They've just got to keep their focus now. Big chance to get them on terms. Oh, it's gone in, and as it stands, they're no longer in line for promotion. Well, the manager will be demanding a response. Messi. Oh, good-looking run. Oh, a goal! And a huge moment. It could be the goal that wins the promotion. Well, just look at those celebrations. Messi. Oh, it's gone in! Just what they wanted. Prepare for promotion. Well, surely they can't let this slip. It must be... The Opportunity, and not quite accurate enough, off the post, and it's going to be a goal kick here, Verratti, oh beating his opponent with ease, might it be Mbappe, a goal, and it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. And he takes on the shot. And not cleared away properly. And a goal it is. But in all honesty, the keeper should have done much, much better. Mbappe. Well, it could be on for him here. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No less...
Excitement in... the Parisian air we're at the Pac de Pass here in the French capital I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson and it has been such a wonderful season it could get even better in this case because they could well be celebrating a title victory it's Paris Saint-Germain against Paris Saint-Germain well what a campaign it's been for them they've been outstanding at times today they just need one more good performance and they will be crowned champions And PSG pushing forward with options available. And pulled back. He's blocked it. Oh, and the decision is penalty. A big chance for them to take the lead here. Well, his name and number have been taken as well, Stuart. And quite rightly so. It was a poor challenge. He was right to give a penalty to the referee. And he's right to give the yellow card. Couldn't grab hold of it. The referee has given a corner. Trying to deliver it accurately. Just wanted to get it out of there. Well, that's how to beat your opponent. Well, he has cause to be grateful to his teammate. He's got space. The cross is on. It has to be. And able to get a body in the way. Well, can they exploit the space out wide? Great opportunity! Oh, it's in! And as things stand, they will be crowned champions! Well, they're in the driving seat. Can they now see this through? Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And the ball is moving again, and the question... And he's broken free! And there it is, a goal! It's just possible that might be the one that wins them the title! Well, look at the celebrations. They certainly believe so. Still a job to do, but surely they won't throw it away from this position. Well, a second goal for them here. And green space galore for PSG. A chance to whip it in. It did look on for them, but not to be. Messi. Close to attack from the wide areas. And a chance here. Hakimi! Verratti! And it goes! Well, it's one goal after another. A highly impressive performance. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. So on with the game. Much to admire about PSG, who look as though they're really in the mood. Nicely timed tackle. And a throw-in it's going to be. Messi. Oh, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. Chance to run at them. But they dealt with the threat posed. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Can they keep it going? 
Well, that break looks still could be dangerous. Decided to take on the shot from a difficult angle. Not a memorable effort, though. Well, you have to question the decision-making there. Could he have cut it back? The angle was always against him. The high press was very much on. Well, just leaning back a bit and over the bar. Well, as the stats confirm, PSG have had the lion's share of possession and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Mbappe. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. An effective challenge. Well, that's not textbook defending. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Chance to finish. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. And taken short. He takes aim. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley. Lionel Messi. Di Maria. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Well, the free kick taken, but saved easily by the keeper. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Marquinhos. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Might it be Mbappe? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Neymar. Neymar moving with authority. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Beautifully weighted ball. Mbappe. Chances on. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. And he's broken free. And collected tidily, he had plenty to think about. Verratti. And intercepted it. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stewart, as always, very keen to get your take. Well, when they play like this, there's such a... Oh, sorry, Stuart, look at this! Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. It's Neymar's corner. Well, still an issue here. Mbappe. Can they get in behind them? Tremendous intuition to win it back. Neymar. What a shocking pass, really. And so the half-time whistle has gone here at the Parc des Princes in Paris. <laughs> Underway in the second half, Paris Saint-Germain have the lead here. And fed forwards. Kylian Mbappe. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations.
Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. Well, it's an out-and-out pasting. 6-0. He's in behind. Big chance it is. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Neymar preferring the inside route. It's got to be Neymar. Oh, burying them beneath an avalanche of goals. No let up here. Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. could pose problems for the defenders now was that the denial of a clear goal scoring opportunity and it was always going to be crystal clear for the referee in terms of the decision well he had to make a tackle didn't he unfortunately it wasn't a good one well that's not one for his personal scrapbook I think it's safe to say well the manager will be absolutely furious it's a waste of a good situation he won't be on the next one that's for sure Messi A real opening now. Is it going to be? Couldn't quite hang on. And an attempt best forgotten, I think. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Might be a chance here. It's opened up for him. And up for grabs off the keeper. And that's the hat-trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, as you can see, the first save is a good one. But they can't react quickly enough to the second ball. The keeper's a bit unlucky, really. have 30 minutes to go Mbappe oh in with a chance well what well, the keeper was called upon and delivered well he's so good in those 1v1 moments and he's proved it yet again and the keeper hangs on at the second attempt well he's done really well hasn't he great stop and then the reaction well not great defending to produce they've delivered the goal well here we can see it again look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself and his movement's so clever once he gets onto it there's only one thought in his head smash it as hard as possible what a good goal well PSG doing well to regain control of the ball Mbappe, chances on. The goal scored by Kylian Mbappe.
And a warm welcome. This is the scene here at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And what a special day on the football calendar. There's nothing quite like the first day of a new campaign. It is Manchester City against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, they were excellent last season, but can they do the same against better opponents? Well, today will be a good test for them, but I think they'll do OK over the season. And it's gone behind for the corner. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Bernardo Silva plays with Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of the pitch. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. No problems grabbing hold of that one. And here's how the lineup looks for PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos at the back. Neymar starts with Lionel Messi in the wide midfield positions. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. Now he must favour the cross. De Bruyne. Well, they have it again. Well, he's the kind of player who you've always got to keep your eye on, Riyad Mahrez. Stuart, what should we... Now, was that the denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity? And in the refereeing trade, they call it Dogzo. Denial of a goal-scoring opportunity. Well, the referees... From a long way out, and how close it was. Well, when you can strike a ball like that, it's always worth a try. A City free kick forthcoming. And now, passing it through. There it is! Down to ten men, but don't write them off just yet. The opening goal, 1-0. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, and once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, they no longer have the ball. Very quick thinking there. And forward this time goes Neymar with options aplenty. And he did what he had to do defensively. Well, that's a well-timed pass. It could be for Raheem Sterling. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. But I think the defending is poor. How can the goalkeeper be left so exposed with two players running at him? Mind you, it's still a great team goal. Well, great read there to intercept. Mbappe. And the flag raised. Offside it is. Disappointing pass. It's an effective run from Di Maria. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. He's enjoying space. Oh, fancy footwork. Cuts it back. Clears it away. Riyad Mahrez. City pushing forward with options available. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. He's lost it. Now they've lost it. Making progress is Kylian Mbappe. Well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Now, high-quality defending. 
Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Will they profit from this situation? And there is the goal! Well, that changes the equation, and they have the momentum now. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, the ball is moving again. The push is on from Paris Saint-Germain. Can they come up with an equaliser? Rodri. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. And barring the door was Laporte. Bernardo Silva. Mares. Mares. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. And there's the delivery. Will they make it count? Rodri. The pressure was high, and they could be in here. And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Neymar. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? But really sticking to their task defensively. This could square the game, and that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them. Well, back underway here, and they've split the four goals between them so far. broken free and just narrowly wide well it's a good effort from that range but I think the keeper had it covered and just one minute of stoppage time say the officials the possession regained by Verassi now well, able to close down the shot a chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half time here As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Kevin De Bruyne on the move. Mares, not to be this time. And threaded through by Mbappe. And still a chance. Di Maria. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. But it is a yellow card, and it seems to be a problem of discipline here, Stuart. Well, this is not the best free kick we'll see today. Well off target. Well, not really what he was looking for there. That's a waste of a good situation. And a throw-in forthcoming. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Grealish. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. And that goes down as a very disappointing attempt. Well, the keeper can't believe his luck. That's a really poor effort. Well, the stats back up what we've seen so far. Some good attacking football, chances for both teams, and plenty to enjoy. Let's hope for more of the same. Well, this is looking promising. And teammates to play it to. Can they forge ahead? It's in! And this really takes your breath away. A comeback and a half.
And Manchester City will go to their bench. So City get things going again. And the onus is on them to erase the damage done by that concession. Substitution for Manchester City. Coming off the pitch, number 14, Amrik Laporte. They've regained possession. Number five, John Stones. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Now what can they produce on the flank? Oh, good looking run. And top notch as well as brave goalkeeping. Well, he comes off his line at just the right time. He read that brilliantly. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Neymar. Well, he just let his opponent glide by. Well, on the final analysis, it was good defending. Danilo Pereira. Neymar. Aimed towards Mbappe. And he's in. And there it is! The equaliser! Down to ten men, but showing guts and determination. Well, it has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Possession given away, unfortunately. And the counter looks on here. Options available. A real opening now. It's opened up for him. Determined defending. Set pieces can be so important. Let's see what City have been working on. A change in the offing for City. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Trying to deliver it accurately. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. Corner once more. Who can they pick out? No spillage from the goalkeeper. Routine. 20 minutes to go. Grealish Gundogan and possession given away well he's going to be disappointed with that pass Bernardo Silva and smart defending well the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack defenders need to cover Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace, the keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Plays it back. And touched onto the frame of the goal. Good pressure, can they make something? Oh, maybe the equaliser! And the flag has gone up. Just when he looked ready to pounce, perhaps. Well, he was just too static in the end, which is a shame because that was a dangerous situation. Is this the moment? So a corner kick it'll be following the deflection. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Sterling, can they stop it going in? He might be able to carve something out. And an attempt best forgotten, I think. 
Well, it's not quite in the history books just yet, but PSG on the cusp of recording a victory. Stuart, how would you critique the performance of this one? Well, what a game this has been. Some of their attacking play has been absolutely brilliant, and there's been some great individual performances as well. But they've been far too open to the counter-attack, and that's why they're still clinging on here. He's got to score! Well, going for power, and so close to finding the net. Messi. And plenty of room in the wide area. 